Welcome at the stand of Seat here at the Geneva Motor Show. Seat is the brand that builds cars for young people, for sporty oriented people. And normally when you talk about a sporty Seat, you say Seat Leon Cupra. But something has changed because now they built a new brand and this brand is called Cupra. This is the new performance label of Seat and this is what they really celebrate here at the stand. Seat celebrates its new performance brand, which is called Cupra. Uh, next to me is Dr. Rabe, he's the head of development and research at Seat. And you brought two very nice things here to the show. What did you bring and what makes these cars so special? Yeah, that's right. The first thing we brought with us is a Cupra e-racer. It's the first electric racing car. And this car has some background because, you know, we are quite successful um, with, with, with motor racing based on the Cupra uh, TCR car, which, which runs in, in the TCR series with the internal combustion engine, that means with a gasoline engine. And even if we love all these gasoline engines, I'm totally sure the future will be electric for, for mobility and why not electric for racing. And therefore we created this Cupra e-racer. But the target was very clear not to have a boring car, just electric. The target was to have a car which at least has the same performance and the same lap times, at least like the internal combustion engine car. And therefore we modified this car huge. That means the center of the car are the batteries. We have a battery of 65 kilowatt hours, a huge battery, which you need for that racing. Um, and the car is rear wheel driven. That means it's the first Leon rear wheel driven. We did it due to the weight distribution. We have engines in the rear. We have also torque vectoring and we have a peak performance of 680 horsepower, yeah? 680 horsepower, which gives the car in fantastic, fantastic performance. Acceleration zero to 200 kilometers in 8.2 seconds, zero to 100, a little bit more than three seconds. But that's important, yeah? We need really um, uh, have a car and to have a car which performs well also in co competition with the other cars. And the important thing, it's not a show car. I don't like show cars. It's a really race prototype. We built actually two cars of that. And we are going to test the car in this season to optimize the car, uh, to learn all about this electric racing, to learn about the energy management, because you have to care for the energy depending on the race distance. And our target is in the final TCR series, which will take place in October in Barcelona, to participate with that car, probably out of competition, but just to show the performance of electrified racing. And we are ready to race maybe next year if something like that is gets the class or class reglement. And therefore, I think it's an exciting future of the racing. It will be a fascinating car, also really fun to drive. That sounds fantastic. But you brought a serious car, a standard uh, serial production car as well, with the name Cupra. What is that? Yeah, that's a Cupra Ateca. And we, as you know, we love Cupra. Even in the past, we had the Leon Cupra, fantastic performing car and this thing or we thought it would fit very well to the Arteca as well. Arteca is a very agile, a compact SUV. And um, what we have now here is the Cupra Arteca that's basically bringing the 300 horsepower gasoline uh, engine in, uh, seven gear, double clutch gearworks, and um, dynamic chassis control, all the ingredients that the car is driving fantastically. With the dynamic chassis control, we can tune the car from more comfort oriented to, to sporty thing, even you could go with that car off-road, but maybe the people will not do so much. But it's a fantastic car, a car which really makes fun. And to be honest, I think a very unique car in that segment, but uh, I'm really looking forward to the car. From now on, you can have the Sierra Leone Cupra R as an estate, which is called ST with the Cupra. That car offers 300 horsepower, four-wheel drive. We have a seven-speed DSG on board, more torque, and very important, even the suspension is now more stiff. Most of you will be aware that you can have Alexa as a service in your car to talk to your car with a Seat. But now Seat offers something brand new, which is Shazam. With Shazam, you have a music uh, recognition service on board, completely safety, completely easy to use. And now you can directly find out 
who is singing your most beloved song. And that's it from the Seat stand from today, from the Geneva Motor Show. We saw loads of very nice cars here, very nice concepts, but my absolute favorite is, of course, the new e-racer, and I'm really hoping that I will have the chance to drive that car on a racetrack sooner or later.